guys welcome back to the vlog it is tuesday morning it is 8 15 i'm about to log on to the computer and get some computer work done first thing <laughs> I've quickly done some computer work. Now it's time to write today's to-do list. I have this notebook here. This one is from Marshalls. I love the covers of these because they're like flexible and soft. And then I have my to-do list over here kind of on my iPad. This is kind of just like a catch-all list that I do for the week. So I want to pick out the things that I need to do today and have them all written down so that we're ready to go and we can kind of check off as we get them done. It is now time to start packing some Etsy orders. So we have quite a lot to grab today. We've got a set of these little ghost earrings, three sets of our disco ball earrings. These two shirts we're gonna make later today. We have a cow print shirt. We have a little um, coin purse, little beaded coin purse, another pair of ghost earrings, another coin purse. This is a large order for tote bags. And then we have these little cowboy boot earrings and then this turquoise clip. I think I'm gonna grab all of the things that I don't have to make, like all of the earrings and accessories that are already created. And then we're gonna work on the t-shirts and the tote bags later whenever I get in my new prints. So I have to go later to pick up the prints from the lady that we get our transfers from. She's local. We're gonna do that later. For now, I think we're just gonna work on the other orders. I'm gonna grab kind of the things that are in those orders and like bring them all over here so that we can go ahead and start packing them. And now we're gonna come over here and grab some of our shipping supplies so that we can get all these things sent out. I know we're going to need one, two, I think a lot of these. So honestly, I'm just gonna bring this whole stack because I'm not 100% sure. I know we're gonna need a few of these small boxes. I think three will be fine. These big boxes, I don't know if they're necessary, but I can probably fit all three pair in one. If not, I'll just grab two. I will need one of these bags. Her cute little poly mailers, I love them, and I think we're good. So let's take all this over to the table. So we have finished packaging up all of these smaller orders. These are all things that are already made and ready to go and be shipped. Now we need to head over and print out their shipping label and weigh them and do all that stuff.
Okay, next up, we are almost out of the pink bubble mailers. These ones that I was using for the jewelry, I really like those for that. And I need to also order for our new little glasses. Let me show you guys, these are so cute. So we are adding these into our shop. This one is currently listed. This is our little ghost glass, perfect for Halloween. We're also gonna be adding in this tall one, which has really cute little pink flowers. And then we have this white one with smiley faces. I think these are all so cute, you guys. Like, just look at them together, they're adorable. By the time you guys see this vlog, they'll probably all be listed so i'll link them down below in the description box for you if you want to go and check them out but i think i really need to order correct packaging for these because i these are obviously are super breakable so i don't want them to break i think i'm gonna go ahead and order some shipping supplies and also all of these cups come with this bamboo lid they're all gonna come with this really cute little bamboo lid and they also come with a little matching glass straw and they're gonna look like this. They're super duper cute. I love them, perfect for coffee or fun drinks. So here is what I'm going to make an order for. We are gonna get some seven by four by four boxes for all of the little can glasses and this should fit both sizes, so I'm happy with that. And this is like a pack of 50, so that should be good. Then I have our normal mailers, which are the eight and a half by 12, but I'm also gonna grab the six by 10 because I think that will just fit the jewelry boxes better. They're a little bit smaller and then I can save these for like our larger orders for like our notepads and things. And then I also have, these are not for work. <laughs> Actually, I might get this, yes. And then this is just another like packaging paper dispenser. So we're gonna get that. And I think I am gonna get this timer. I think it'll just be really helpful for a lot of the like printing with this printer here and just for the heat press in general our heat press has one on there but just for other projects it's just really good to know so i think i'm going to order these and we'll be good for that so i made a very quick like impromptu decision to update a few things on our website i felt like the front just needed a little bit of a sprucing up but we added a couple of new banners we have the flower claw clips button this is an old one here and then we have our fall is here one so you can go and shop all of our fall items which i'm so excited about literally it'll take you to this page where you can literally see all of the t-shirts sweatshirts and cute little accessories that we have that are all fall related it is literally so fun and so many more are going to be coming to that one very very soon we also updated some little of our category covers so we've got hair accessories stationery and graphic tees we've got our featured item of the week which are our disco ball earrings i think we only have two more pairs of those left so if you want a pair make sure you snag them and then we've got our email sign up and typical stuff so i really like how that looks i think it looks so much better than our last one and now it is like 10 o'clock i can go and pick up the shirts from the warehouse at 11 and then at 12 i can pick up my transfers and i potentially have a tour at two for an office space. He still hasn't gotten back to me, so I'm not 100% sure about that yet. And it's up near where our transfer lady is, so I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should wait or try and reach out to him or something like that. We are potentially looking into purchasing an office space, leasing really, but we're looking into moving to office space because as you guys can tell, this office is just too small for us at this point, and we really want something that's in between my mom and I so we can both easily access it. I'm gonna go because I need to go and charge our car. I'm gonna get some lunch and we're gonna drop off some packages. We got a lot to do, so let's go. I'm charging the car right now, and I got some lunch to sit here while I'm waiting. Of course, I got some Chick-fil-A. Mm, yummy, yummy, yummy. Dropped off the packages at UPS and USPS. The next task after I charge is going to the t-shirt warehouse to pick up my t-shirt blank. Most people order their like blank t-shirts and stuff for their businesses online. We actually have one in my city and they allow you to do pickup and it's like same day pickup. So it actually works out fantastic for us in our business. So I'm gonna go and grab those today. Afterwards, I need to grab the transfers for our shirts. We have a local person who makes those for us. They are DTF transfers. Snagged our t-shirts and tote bags. Toss them back in the trunk because the warehouse was super busy. There was literally so many people there. So I didn't want to vlog in front of them. Taco taco. We're going to pick up the transfers now. Okay, we have got the goods. This is the name of the lady who does our prints. We've got all of our prints here and everything looks good. 
Okay, so just a little bit about the lady that we buy transfers from. If you are a small business, I'm going to link her down below because y'all will love her. If you need transfers, like heat press transfers for shirts, apparel, whatever, she should be your go-to gal. She is local for us, so we can do local pickup, but she does also send orders online, so you can order them on her website. What's great about her is she has no minimum order, you guys. She has no minimum order, so if you only need like one or two transfers for your design, she's got you so y'all need to go check her out leave it in the notes of your order if you can um that lauren sent lauren from cotswold and co sent you um i don't get anything from doing this i just think it's fun to share and support other small businesses just finished touring the first office and we loved the space but they wanted a three-year lease term and that's not our vibe we just don't think like we'll want to be in the same space in three years that's just a really long lease term so for us it just wasn't fitting but the space was gorgeous i mean it literally was like a perfect office space really great to grow in tons of storage lots of areas for us to create and store inventory and all those kind of great things but this wasn't the right match it was a little expensive as well so that's fine not too worried about that all right guys we are officially back home and i was supposed to go to our second one this afternoon and my mom and i decided the location is not ideal for our situation. No more office tours today and sadly that one was a no. That's okay because we will find something that works for us. I'm sure of it. But I have a couple of shirts and things that I need to get done here in the office so that I can send out a couple more orders and one wholesale order. I messed up some hoodies the other day for this wholesale order that's down here. So I need to fix both of those. And I got some really cute new prints for some trucker hats that we're going to be working on. Look how cute these turned out. They say howdy, not in the mood. And then I got a second howdy so I could have a couple more of them and she gave me extras which was really sweet of her i'm gonna prop you guys up we're gonna turn on the heat press and we're gonna get to pressing because i got some work to do Okay, we got our prints. So earlier I showed you guys, someone ordered seven of our little Howdy tote bags. So I have a bunch of those. There's also a shirt order for that. And then someone else ordered our Better Days Ahead design. So the heat press is heated up. Let's move over. Okay, all of the presses are officially done. Now what we need to do is peel them all and then we have to press them all one more time to really get everything like embedded into the threads. So let's start peeling.
I'm so pleased because all of the designs turned out perfect. All of the bags turned out perfect. We just need to do a second press on everything and then we are done. The mushroom hoodie was part of a wholesale order and I have all of the other pieces in here and then underneath are a bunch of pink sweatshirts. So what I need to do is fold these all up to fit nicely into this box and then print a shipping label for it and get it out the door. By the way, pretty much everything that you've seen today and anything that we have in our shop, we do sell in wholesale so if you are a boutique or small business and you want to sell something in your shop that we've created we do have a wholesale store you can buy them basically at like a discounted price so that you can then make a profit and sell them in your shop I'll have a link down below if you want to go and check it out I also believe that if it is the first time that you're purchasing on that website um, you get a hundred dollars off your order so yeah kind of a good deal <laughs> Now it's time to package this tote bag order. So this girl ordered seven of our Howdy tote bags. I think her and some friends are taking a trip to Nashville. I wanted to get this out fast for her because they have their trip coming up soon. I'm going to leave them like this and then I think put them in a yellow envelope mailer and then just grab some freebie stuff. Okay, I found a box to work. have finished this order and it's off to its new home so I can set it out here now we've got our little stack lastly I am just going to finish up and mail these shirts here behind me just to go ahead and get the shipping labels on them and be done for the day and then we're done <laughs> go out here and add them to my pile all right you guys that is gonna be it for today's vlog i hope that you guys enjoyed following along on today's studio vlog and just seeing the behind the scenes of everything make sure you guys head on over to cotton if you want to check anything out that you saw today as well as if you're interested in wholesale i'll have all that information linked in the description box for you guys to go and check out after you're done watching right here on the screen for you guys i'm going to link another studio vlog this is the last one uploaded on my channel as well as an entire playlist full of them so if you want to go and binge watch more down here you're going to find my subscribe button so you guys can stick around for more videos without further ado guys that brings us to the end thank you so much for watching see you guys